There is nothing more beautiful than someone who goes out their way to make their lives beautiful for others. Our reigning Miss Naglin Dikonya Satsu, author of the book and my very own dear friend, has proven to be an exemplary figure in this regard. Her Beauty with a Purpose project started with a small cleanliness drive during the lockdown. It saw a greater opportunity to connect and spread a moral message to the society. Through that, her next phase of her Beauty with a Purpose project included the selling of vegetables to help the local farmers and street vendors during the COVID pandemic. Later, her 12th district tour took place uh, with a motive to reconnect with the roots and to promote history and culture of the long lost Nagas, where she ended her tour with a goodwill charity program. I stand here today on behalf of the Beauty and Aesthetic Society of Nagaland. First of all, to congratulate our Miss, many Miss Nagaland, Miss Likonyo, for successfully completing her Beauty with a Project themed like new generation and education. And also for the documentary and the copy table book It is indeed a very significant achievement and we are immensely filled with pride and happiness on this very day. Uh, I, on behalf of our Adult Society, would like to invite the Bikoni of the Brethren to come up to We have time again and again done things that uh, we were not able to do, but uh, we have gone ahead and then we have at least uh, let people know that there is a society, there are people working for young girls and beauty pages. Thank you, don't steal, don't cheat, don't lie. I know you got mountains to climb, but always stay humble and kind. Dreams, your dream and come to you when the work you put in is realized. Let yourself feel the pride, but always stay humble and calm. To begin with, uh, it is an honor and it is my privilege to come in the same place where I started off my journey. I gave my Miss Naglin audition in the same place, uh, same place two years back and today I would be uh, standing here wearing this crown and sash for the last time before I pass on my crown to the new Queen of Naglin. When we talk about beauty industry in Naglin, it is very uncertain and pathetic. Uh, we are still yet to accept what should be accepted. Uh, however, in the society that we live today, uh, they are those people who uplift us and they are those people who help us to learn what good and bad is. Uh, pageant industry has always been uncertain, like I mentioned, and uh, when you talk about the title of Miss Nadlin, it's a big responsibility for me. And uh, the time that I was crowned as Miss Nadlin 2019, one thing I was clear about was what I wanted to do, the vision I had for Nadlin, and the fact that I wanted to do something for my people here in our state. Um, I grew up wanting to be Miss Nagaland and every time I talk to people about the fact that someday I will become Miss Nagaland, I always get a tangled reaction from people because uh, this kind of profession is still very uncertain in our society. Um, I also know the fact that uh, this has been a roller coaster ride for me, fulfilling the duties of Miss Nagaland. Uh, however, the vision, the purpose that this title has given me, I think I am very grateful. I have encountered people who has shown much love, support, and honor to the crown and sash that I wear today. It is my privilege and an honor 
to release this documentary teaser as well as this book uh, on behalf of the entire Naglin. And I hope and pray that even as I pass on this crown to our new Miss Naglin, she would carry the same legacy and she would be able to represent us Nagas in a very proper way because I believe that through this title so much can be done. And uh, last but not the least, I would like to thank everyone for supporting me, for helping me to reach, to come this far and... Especially traveling the 12 districts of Nagaland, I have been blessed by so many of them, especially the senior citizens and everyone who have shown so much of love and support towards me. Uh, I feel that this honorable title, this honorable position is something we need to respect as an institution. However, the honor and dignity of that institution is the responsibility of the reigning Miss Nagle to actually qualify and also in the process take it to another level. And I believe that because of social media today, every action of ours is looked at by the entire society at a microscopic level. So it's very important that when we mention the word role model, we should be serious about performing not only the duty of a role model, but also as a leader in this sector for all the young people who looks up to a Nam. That with the dignity an honor you bring to your title by your conduct and by your initiative. This purpose, Beauty with a Purpose project, will take you to another level and take you to levels which the society will appreciate. And that is very important. Today we really need role models who will encourage our youth to go beyond spending half their day on Instagram to performing and showing us through their hard work that they also can bring change in the society instead of just expecting change from others. So this is something which you will be encouraging our youths with. So therefore, with all this, I would like to again congratulate you and wish you all the best in the days to come. Thank you.